to a Better World. This is your host, Mitchell J. Rabin, and I'm very glad you're joining us again today. Today, we are on location in Beverly Hills, California, in LA, at the Beneveda Healing Center. And we are here to learn about the way allopathic conventional medicine can work hand in hand with integrative medicine, energy medicine, the medicine of innovation, and the kind of medicine and healing that is moving rapidly forward in our world. We're creating a quantum field, if you will, of understanding and how we can, as human beings, reach our levels of potential. And it's really interesting to see how the ideas of contemporary healing and the interface with technology are helping to bring us forward in this purpose and this intention. So one of the leaders in this field of integrative medicine and energy medicine happens to be a pediatric surgeon. His name is Dr. Tom Loeb. He is our guest today and we are seated in his center and we'll be learning from him about the way he is in his particular way bringing together these two seemingly disparate fields under one roof. Hi Tom. Hi, how are you? Great. Thank you for having me on the show today. It's my pleasure. It's great to have you. And uh, you're doing some real innovative stuff here, and I really want to share that with our audience that really needs to know about the choices they have available, that they're not limited, they're actually expansive. And you're helping to bring that to the Beverly Hills and the larger L.A. area altogether. First of all, just a quick sketch. How is it that you got started with this kind of thinking? I think I was born that way, uh, to, the, <laughs> that to this thinking. And, yeah. and uh, as we've talked about before, this really uh, probably was instigated when I was an infant, uh, a small child. Instigated. Uh, was, was a <laughs> yeah. patient uh, right. in... Uh, you yourself. Uh, yeah, I, in, in a children's hospital, uh, where, uh, for about six months, uh, and I didn't feel that I was treated the way I should be felt. And I remember very vividly having thoughts uh, at age two, two and a half, that I, I can do this better. A patient should be treated better. Uh, there's got to be something more mm. than, than, than what's happening to me now. Uh, sometimes it'd be three or four in the morning when I'd be up. I'm still up at that hour, but, but, but as a child, I should have been asleep. And, and uh, always wanted to be a healer, always uh, was a bit of a scientist. Uh, always very curious uh, and wanted to know what else is there. There has to be something more. 